into your marriage I would like you to be kind to your husband to be committed uh, be there for your family trust in God in everything okay John uh, now you are getting married to Nelly I would like you to be a good husband take care of Nelly be the man of the house and uh, take care of your family and above all i wish you all the best and let god be there for you uh, put god first in everything that you do i was attached to john at quite an early age at quite a young age um, i remember my mother giving me a story of how i used to cling to him whenever we went to uh, we were going to church for, for the Sunday school service and I wouldn't want to leave him. Our relationship grew and he has influenced me a lot in, in the career path that I'm, I am supposed to take. He's the one who influenced me in, in music actually. He was the, the first person who taught me my first guitar chord and yeah. So I'd say it's, it's quite a strong bond. I, I, I feel a bit sad letting him go. Now I'm there. Na John, mwende mkuwe na mboma enyu mzuri, mkuwe na maisha mzuri, na wekeni maisha enyu raisi, na mutaishi maisha mazuri, mbate watoto, wakuje wanite shusho, litafuraia. We always look forward to a time like this. Yes. So we really want to thank God. Yes. Najua Mama Nelly ayasasema mabomigi sana. Lakini Mama Nelly, as you give out your daughter, 
and your only daughter, what do, would you want to tell her today? Okay, Nelly, my loving, beautiful daughter, I really love you. You've been a very inspirational to me, and I want to thank you so much. Now, as I give out to Mr. and Mrs. Uh, I give out to you to Mr. and Mrs. Kemoy's family, I want you to be a good girl when you go there. You and John, we are praying for you so that you may have a good family. I really love you people. Wow. And I want wow. to thank you very much. You have been so good to me. You have been there for us. Oh. Wow. We can uh, attend to Afura here as they do this. Okay, Asanti. Bwana Sifiwe. Amen. Eh, leo ni siku ambayo tuko na furaha sana. Thank you, Mois. Kwa sababu Mungu anatuongezea Bwana Sifiwe. Amen. Na leo ni kiongozi wa mrembo hivi. Naweza ninaweza sema confidently kwamba ni maombi ambayo imejibiwa. Na sita kosa kuwa nasema vile nilikuwa na desire ya kupata msichana mm. na nirudie jina yangu. Sana sifiwe. Amen. Sijui kwa nini kwa na feel hivyo zamani wakati nilikuwa napata watoto. Kwa nasema tu nikipata msichana nitamuita mdengu kama mimi. Because it's a good name. Na Mungu akamleta na sasa vile alikuja nikajua kabisa. Huyu ni Mungu. We are in the perfect will of God. Nelly, tunakupenda sana kwa kimois. Na tunakupokea with a lot of gratitude. Thank you so much, Mama Nelly. Kwa kumulea msiana murembo, mzuri. Na umetupatia kwa rosafi. Tangu tufuje kwa hii boma. Umetupokea vizuri. Na tunashukuru mungu. Tulipata kibali machoni pa familia ya pita. Na tunaesa. Naesa ongea mpaka kesho because... Ni mambo mazuri bwana asifiwa. Hawajawahi kusumbua na tunashukuru Mungu. Amen. Tunampokea Neli na tutamtunza kama mtoto wetu. Kuanzia leo you are part of our family. Aya basi sijui nitasema nini. Kukaribisha kwa hii jamii ya Kimoi. Karibu sana na uchisikie huru na you are part of our family. Previously, I used to think uh, Sina was Chana, but I'm going to be able to get out of here. Okay, 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 like I can make a joke with my sister that I know Nikki make namtu mwingine hata get na ile uh, she can make a joke with me that she knows I will get because it's not easy to find somebody who you can vibe with like that middle age um, my sister was very kind actually she got me out of a lot of tough spots John is a uh a young man and um, he's a man who is very focused in everything that he does and also he's a man when he says yes he's yes when he says no he's no saa hii hata venye anaenda kuanza jamii yake ile kitu naweza sema sasa ile uoga nilikuwa nayo yote imeisha kwa sababu nimeona he can manage he can manage himself nikuja kunjiuliza nikapata I think it's because he was my firstborn and it was my first experience. Killer stage of his life it was a first experience to me. Na saa hii ile kitu naweza sema Mungu amekuwa na yeye siku zote 
na hata vile anaenda kuanza jamii yake siku ya leo niko na uhakika kwamba Mungu atampigania na atamuonekania na atampatia ndoa yenye iko na furaha na amani this will be a good day um, uh, we waited for this day we will celebrate we will enjoy we will um, have a good time looking forward to spending the rest of my life with you And I'm just so grateful for this opportunity to be together with the brethren and just be able to celebrate this too. I just want to announce that we are just so proud of how they've chosen to do this day. Uh, many people are taking other ways that are not scriptural and biblical. But we are so grateful to the Lord that they've chosen to be such a good, good example, especially for their generation. Give them a round of applause as they come in. Hey! 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 One of them in a daddy, well, we. Hey! Wow, 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 wow. So, so amazing. Are you your relation? I told you to for that. Ladies, give me some your relations. Uh huh. We can just clap our hands there. Hey, 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 hey,
I'm gonna say you are the love. You are the love that never leaves. Kuna watu walilipana hapa, I'm seeing them. Uh -huh. Now listen. You make something out of nothing.
successful marriage we need to be aware that there are certain ways we can live so that we are happy and we enjoy marriage Bwana Yesu as if he was son now I like beginning with the first one the first ingredient in your marriage my brother John and sister Nelly it is love anything that brings you together without love is a waste of time if it is a title you are looking for, don't look for a title without love. If there is no love, it will take just two, three days or one month, and then you sasa munaishi ile maisha kuvumiliana, kungangana, na kukaa tu watu waone, munaendelea vizuri, lakini kwa nyumba, maisha ni ngumu. Uku inje, tunapretend maneno ni mazuri, lakini kwa nyumba, Kuna shida. Iyo ndiyo atutaki. Kwa hivyo ndoa, lasma yanze na upendo. Kukiwa hakuna upendo, hakuta kuwa na amani kwa hiyo doa. John, you must speak that one strongly. If you did not love Nelly, if you loved Nelly because she just looks beautiful, hiyo beauty sa ingine inaishanga. Inateremuka, inatoka. After a few days, Nelly will not be smiling with the smile you are seeing. She will be smiling differently. So it is only love that will keep you loving, Nelly. Hallelujah. Eh? Saingini unakuwa vile uko, very handsome man. And uh, after some time, through what I like calling weathering in, in, in geography, and environmental degradation, <laughs> inakugwara mpaka... Hata iyo, iyo, iyo meno inaanza kuenda pande hii. <laughs> Nelly, will you still love John? If there was no love, I'm telling you, you start seeing other young, beautiful men. Young, looking, nice, well-fashioned men. Better than John. So there must be love in your marriage. Bwana Yesu was if you son. The Bible says in Proverbs chapter 10, verse 12, hatred stirred up strife, but love Covereth all sins. Upendo peke yake ndiyo inafunika madhambi yote. Hata kukiwa makosa, upendo ndiyo itafunika hiyo madhambi yote. Kwa hivyo lasima tuangalia upendo iwe kwa maisha yetu. Bwana Yesu asifiwe sana. First Peter chapter 4 verse 8 says, And above all things, have fervent charity among yourself. For charity shall cover the multitude of sin. It's a repetition, quoting Proverbs, showing that iu pendo ni kitu chamahana sana kwa maisha yetu. Na kuambia, unajua vijana tunapendana kwa iyo, iyo kitu inaetua, unasikia tu manginet, unasikia, unasikia musismuko kwa mwili. Kwa hivyo si upendo ni tu umesikia kitu kinakimbia kimbia kwa mwili alafu unakimbia una, unachukua kamusiana karembo after one year my friend hiyo msisimuko inatoroka what will leave you hanging on is love if there was love kama hakukuwa na love hiyo kitu inasarabati inasarabatika sasa then is unanisaidia kwa swahili najua <laughs> shule nilisikoa kitu kibaya hata sitaki kuambia so, so the Bible commands us to love our wives. 
If you look at Ephesians chapter 5, verse 21, you'll be surprised. It says, submitting yourselves one to another in the fear of God. Submitting yourselves one to another in the fear of God. I know within the same, it tells women submit. But I wanted to show you that it also says submitting one to another, which means also men must submit to their wives. Amen. And women must submit, submit to their husbands. Amen. Now, that in ingredient is so key in our lives if we don't submit to one another. I was trying to look at the, the meaning of submission. Submission is surrendering all of yourself to another person. Unajua wanaume wako na kichwa ngumu. Kwa hivyo lazima tuwagonge sana. Wanaume hawataki kusubmit kwa wanawake. Wanafikiri nimekaliwa. Kukaliwa is the best thing I've seen in marriage. <laughs> Neli ukifika kwa nyumba kalia njoni sana. <laughs> kwa sababu kimukalia vizuri maisha itaendelea vizuri. Praise the Lord. Mimi nimekaliwa that for years. <laughs> Na unaona niko aje. Naendelea vizuri. Kila chochote nimepata njon, ni kukaliwa. Ile nyumba nimejenga ni kukaliwa. <laughs> Ile mahali nimenunua ni kuishi ni kukaliwa. I know wanaume hawataki kusikia hiyo message. But I'm telling you it is one of the best messages men should take home. I'm not saying that women will sit on you, literally. But women will have a say in your house. Amen. Unajua wanawake wamekaliwa mpaka awaongei. Mzee akiingia, wanaka, wana, kuna wazee wengine akitoka kilabu, kilabu, ukunywa pombe. Na alikuja akiwa sawa, mahali alitoka. Hakifika kwa ngeiti pale anaanguka chini. Anaanza kuroo. Hey, bibi yangu, Nelly uko wapi? Hey, hey. Unaenda kumuokota huko kwa, kwa matope. Unamutua viatu, unamubeba. Now the guy was okay before he came. He was okay. Then he begins to ask you a question. Na wewe ni wanani? Nelly wewe ni wanani? Na wewe ni wanani? I'm telling you, you can't build a home like that. A home is built through submission. See slavery. Kukanyanga mtu mpaka can never say anything. In your house, as a husband, you facilitate discussions. Facilitate. Where when your chairman? Biblia inakuita kichwa. Kichwa si mtu ya kuchapa watu viboko. Ni mtu ya kusimamia na kusema unataka tuende jiagani. Nelly. Nelly anasema, situ njaribu hii. Uzebi hapana. Unazema, unaona hiyo njia ni kwa nini? Facilitation. Am I speaking to somebody? Yes. Si hile umangaha wana waume, anataka akiongea, akisema, kila mwanamuke anakuja speed. Anasema, umesema nini? That is not a submission I'm talking about. I'm talking about submission with love. Na hii ni ingredient ni nzuri sana kwa sisi sote. Inaitua hona, hona. Hona, it is the highest respect that you can give to somebody. Highest respect. It is the highest esteem. Where both of you esteem each other with a lot of humility and a lot of honoring one another. You know why I'm putting this? Because, na hii kitu ni chamahana sana. Kwa sababu, Sisi tunaishi maisha ya ulimu, maisha ya sikuizi, tumeendelea sana. We are living in a modern society. Si society kama hile my father used to live with my mother. We are living in a modern society where women have gone to school. Na wamesoma sa ingine more than the men. We are living in a society where women are now working. And some of them are earning more salary than us. Yo ni kweli. Ukienda pale kwa barbara usimame. 
na uhesabu ile mangari inapitia hapo na nani anaendesha hiyo ngari na size ya hiyo ngari enda unifanyie hiyo hesabu Uta, utashtuka wanawake siku hizi hata wengine ni kidogo sana waoni mbele wanaweka matwe huko wanaweka pilo waone mbele ameendesha ile V8 anapita eh na atuongei we don't talk they pass Ukiangalia mwanaume anapitwa amemendesha kale ka kitu kanaitwa kale ka gari kanaitwa nini kale ka wazi kale kanabeba nyasi ya ngombe e probox mzee anapitwa hapo na ka probox kabusiana kajana kanapita hapo na v ukikaa kari ya ndio hiyo mwanamke unakaa brado ndio hiyo mwanamke oh na wanaume tu wako I'm telling you so you cannot you cannot rule you cannot rule the family John the way our fathers used to rule our families it can't work unacheza hivi kidogo wewe ndio unafukuzwa kwa hiyo nyumba Nelly Sarah was calling the husband my lord in other words you should be when when he end as say my lord how are you? <laughs> no, i'm not teaching you that i'm only showing you the level sarah respected abraham are you getting me yes. the the high level of esteem in the family yes. where sarah would consider the husband as my lord we should respect our wives also give them high level of esteem mm. if your wife performs well congratulate her take up for an evening party bring her a present tell her i love you men don't tell their wives we love even me i'm a culprit i i struggle to tell my wife i love her but now publicly i love you <laughs> we should men we should learn to love one another and esteem our wives Amen. 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 Esteem our wives. Amen. Wakifanya kitu kizuri, celebrate your wife. Amen. Amen. Your husband, women are good in this some some of them. Nowadays wako na manga. <laughs> Please honor your husband. Don't just shout at your husband. Hey John. No. Give, give him honor. Amen. <laughs> hey Bona bona huku 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 fanya ugali wewe that it was your turn <laughs> to cook ugali and the visitors are around then they look at John John you mean in your house you are the one who makes ugali <laughs> eh na tadu he we we am educated like you i earn a salary like you why can't he do ugali let that be your own small secrets in your house <laughs> number four, faithfulness being faithful i have never seen anything that breaks marriages like being unfaithful yes hadi kuwa uko na msichana mwingine mahali eh have you seen the men of today when you are driving and your wife is here and a beautiful girl passes on the other side the men even forget they have a beautiful wife in the car <laughs> they are busy looking at the beautiful girl passing mpaka anashikwa na mama wewe na mna gani Never be unfaithful to your wife. And <laughs> women are better they forgive men, but men don't forgive women. The moment a man discovers nearly you are not faithful. Hakuna negotiation. No, men are so bad. They don't even negotiate with their wives. You are cheating on me? In the kwisha. It is done. It is final. Even if pastors come and pray no 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 the wife is moving with another man but when a man moves with another woman the wives are like we can tolerate that because you know it's a man no that is <laughs> that is not the way it should be faithfulness is very important i will not read any scripture because of time number 5 and the final one in my in my in, in ingredients is about everything you have had everything you have had god comes fast 
God is the author and the finisher of our lives. Amen. God is the creator and the, institution, the one who institutionalized marriage. Mungu mwenyewe ndiyo alileta doa. Kwa hivyo tumweke mbele kwa maisha yetu. Tukiweka Mungu mbele ya maisha yetu hata kukiwa na vitu zingine kwa nyumba mtaomba kwanza. Na mukiomba hiyo kitu inakuwa sorted. Even when temperatures are going up. Nelly, temperatures go up. You don't think you will always be happy. Temperatures go up. But when they go up, tell him let's pray. Mukiomba after that you see him smiling. That is what God does in marriages. God is so special in our lives. So let's put God first in our marriages. And if you follow those, those five ingredients, your marriage will be happy. It will be successful. You will live many years like some of us. We haven't left many. We, we still want to live up to Umeona Queen Yamekufa to the other day. She has lived. And, uh, and uh, Charles has waited for 73 years to become king. <laughs> And this woman is not going. <laughs> so we want to live. And live for many years. But we don't want to live many years with the pain. Yes. And the toleration. Tolerating one another. And wondering why do you like to marry. It is not good. We need to live happy. And be very excited. Like I am today. I am very excited. I have a beautiful wife called Queen. The Queen of England. Can you rise up and just wave like this. I want them to know. You can live for many years. With a beautiful wife. Yes. God bless you. <laughs> it is possible. It is possible. Now, dear friends, we are... We um, are going to John with Mr. Nauru and John. Maybe we can give them a mic if they have anything to say. You can also greet each other. Mama Mimesis Kimoi na na Mzee Kimoi mnaweza kusalimia hao wazazi, mwashukuru. Mseme asante tumepata msichana ambao tuko na yeye. Hii miaka yote tumeishi. Yes. Anything to say? Mm, yeah. Uh, I have something to say to the both uh, the family and Nelly. Yes. Nelly, my only loving daughter. Uh, today I have the pleasure to hand you over to John to be your husband and of course to the family of uh, Kemois. And it is my desire and uh, it is my desire for them to take a great care of you, Amen. as we have been doing. Thank you. Asante. And Leo, Niko na furaha mingi. Wana tukipea kiana wetu hapa. Ajoin musiana wetu. Wala wanaishi kwa kwa upendo. Na Na sita zutu vitu kada Ile first time send Don't go offside those If you don't You will never repeat First waleo Kila kitu amenguzia na Kikawa kama kiminyoroka Kwa hivu watoto wangu Mwende mkawa mfuate maangisi wa Fasta na mutakawa kama mwenyoroka Asante Asante Nika mawazazi wa John wako na jambo na kusema. Bwana sifiwe. Amen. E, leo ni siku kubwa sana kwetu, yes. thank you Mois. E, itakuwa siku ya kukumbuka. We are receiving the first girl in our family. Bwana sifiwe. Tumebarikiwa na vijana watatu. John is our firstborn. And I'm so grateful. Kwamba... Siku ya leo, tunampokea Nelly na ninaamini kwamba Nelly amekuja kwetu na ni kwa mapenzi ya mungu. Amen. Mungu wa wabariki na tunawaombea, mukaishi vizuri, mukapendane, 
na mkafu hata hizo maangizo pasta amesema na Mungu atawabariki Ah uh, habari zenu wapendwa bwana sifiwe pia mimi ninataka kusema kama baba ya John niko na furaha sana kukaribisha kwetu kuwe pamoja na sisi na tunakuhakikishia kwamba ni fine in our family God bless you so much thank you thank you so let me request the parents to just sit as i read this to these two this is your great day Dear friends, we are gathered here today before the Almighty God and this congregation to witness the joining together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. This is a special sacred service which was instituted by God himself when he first made Adam and placed him in the Garden of Eden and later said that it is not good for man to be alone. The God the Lord God himself therefore formed the woman Eve and brought her to Adam to be his wife thus ordaining this institution of marriage. The Lord Jesus Christ also blessed the marriage institution when he attended the wedding in Cana of Galilee where he performed his first miracle by turning water into wine. Now these two brother John Gishure and sister Nelly Mudeu wish to enter into this sacred institution which the apostle paul also exalts it to be honored by all and the marriage bed to remain undefiled for as any man who wishes to enter to this institution must do it with due consideration and all carefulness knowing that anyone who gets into this institution Without the blessing of God, such a union is null and void in the sight of God. Now these two people wish to enter into this holy matrimony and if anyone can show any just reason why these two should not be joined together lawfully, let him or her declare it now or forever remain silent. Je, kuna yoyote ambayo yuko na sababu ambayo inaeleweka na ambayo inaweza kusimama the test of time as to why how are we wasiunganishwe pamoja kuna yote hakuna kwa hivyo unyamaze hivyo mpaka siku ile Yesu atakaporudi hebu tuwapigie makofi yes. now i want to talk to you too as you shall answer in the day of judgment, John and uh, Nelly, all the secrets of man's heart shall be revealed. I demand of you both that if either of you know of any just reason why you cannot be lawfully joined together in the holy state of marriage, that you shall declare it now, for you should know surely that those who are joined together in any way other than God's law, um, allow, are not joined together by God, nor is their marriage lawful. Now, Nelly, is there any reason why you should not be lawfully married to John? Maybe you had a dream last night, <laughs> and you saw a vision, heavens opened. Any just reason? Yes or no? There is no reason. There is no reason. And John, is there a reason why you should not be married to Nelly? Maybe God talked to you last night. You know Joseph was also talked to. You remember Joseph on the bike? Yes. Did God say something? No. <laughs> okay. There is no just reason. I want you to unveil uh, Nelly. Just unveil her. Only unveiling. Is she the one? To endele ama to say endele? To endele. Okay, so. Now, John Gishure, do you take this woman to be your lawfully wedded wife, to live together in the way God has commanded, 
in the holy state of marriage. John, do you take this one? Yes or no? Yes. You can say yes, I do, or no, I don't. Yes, I do. So that from Maliza to Enda to Kulogali, I love you too. Will you love, honor, and care for her through all the changing circumstances of life? And forsaking all others, cleave only to her as long as both of you shall live. John, you can answer yes, I do, or yes, I don't. To Maliza to Enda to Kulogali. Yes, I do. Yes, you do. Let's give them a hand. Now, Nelly, I want you so to tell this congregation, yes, I do, or no, I don't, to this statement I'm going to make to you. Do you take this man to be your lawfully wedded husband, to live together in the way God has commanded in the holy state of marriage? Yes, I do. Yes, you do. Will you love, honor, and obey him through all the changing circumstances of life and forsaking all others and cleave to him as long as both of you shall live? Nelly, you can tell us yes, you do, or no, you don't. Yes, I do. Yes, you do. Hallelujah. Now, just hold um, John's right hand. Take Nelly by her right hand and look into her eyes, John. Yes. I know her eyes look very different from the way you saw her. Actually, but still look into them. Give him a microphone. Let him say this. Um, I, John, be sure that you're I, John Gechura Kimoi. Take you, Nelly Mary Mudeu. Take you, Nelly Mary Mudeu. To be my lawfully wedded wife. To be my lawfully wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. To live with you from this day forward. To live with you from this day forward. Through all changing circumstances of life. Through all changing circumstances of life. I will love you. I will love you. Honor. Honor you. And be beside you. Whether it be for better. Whether it be for better. Or for worse. Or for, worse. for richer. For richer. Or for, or for poorer. In sickness. In sickness. And in health. And in health. I, want you to know that I want you to know that. I will forsake all other women. I will forsake all other women. And cleave to you. And cleave to you. And you and you alone. And you and you alone. As long as both of us shall live. As long as both of us shall live. Please know that you are the woman. Please know that you're the woman of my choice, of my choice. And, this day, and this day I give you my vow, I give you my vow and, I give you my and I give you my promise. I love you. I love you. <laughs> Let's just compose yourself. <laughs> Take you, John. Take you, John, if you recommend me. To be my lawfully wedded husband. Be my lawfully wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. To live with you from this day forward. To live with you from this day forward. Through all the changing circumstances of life. Through all the changing circumstances of life. I will love. I will love. Honor. Honor. And be beside you. And be beside you. Whether it be for better. Whether it be for better or for worse. Or for, worse. for richer. For richer. Or for poorer. Or for poorer. In sickness. In sickness. And in health. And in health. I want you to know. I want you to know. That I will forsake all other men. That I will forsake all other men. And cleave to you. And cleave to you. And you. And you. And you alone. And you alone. As long as both of us shall be. As long as both of us shall live. Please know that. Please know that. You're the man of my choice. You're the man of my choice. And this day. And this day. I give you my vow. I give you my vow. And I give you my promise. And I give you my promise. I love you, John. I love you, John. <laughs> You can put that ring slowly and say, with this ring, with this ring, I, John Kishure, 
Ai John Kichure. Do it you nearly with you. This ring. With this ring. I give you my vow. I give you my vow. With this ring. With this ring. I give you my promise. I give you my promise. I love you, Nelly. I love you, Nelly. <laughs> With this ring, I do wed you. I, I do wed you, John. I do wed you, John. With this ring, with this ring, I give you my vow. I give you my vow. With this ring, with this ring, I give you my promise. I give you my promise. I love you, John. I love you, John. <laughs> Now I want us to pray for these two as they begin their life together. Father, we want to proclaim your blessings yes. upon them today. Yes. Asking may it overshadow them, may it chase them, yes. may it run them over. Yes. As this marriage, as we had earlier, is a yes. representation yes. of the marriage between Christ and the church. Yes. And how important it is for this two to live up yes. to that standard. Father, we pray for the blessings of the Lord yes. to come upon their lives yes. and overtake them, Lord, according yes. to Scripture. Yes. May you bless them, Lord. Yes. May you increase them, King of glory. Yes. As they begin this life, mm. let it be a good life for them. Yes. Let them be blessed, King yes. of glory. Yes. Bless them, Lord, yes. in the city yes. and bless them in the countryside. Yes. Thank you, Father. Lord, we are just saying thank you. Thank you, Lord for this dear ones lord may you bless them yes. lord even as we have prayed we ask that lord you may remember them yes. in jesus name we do pray and believe amen. amen and amen and amen hallelujah i now declare you husband and wife in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit hallelujah You may now kiss your bride. Usiniangalie mimi. So let's give them their certificate. Their certificate. Okay, let's make a valid work. It's now my great pleasure to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Kishure. And therefore, what God has put together, let no man put asunder. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. And all of us say, Amen, 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 Amen. amen, amen. amen. Smile, smile, Niwako Buana, smile. Hey, Bas. <laughs> Tango tulipo 
kukutana Kula sizi tukapatana Na ni mbali tumetoka Tangu kuchumiana Siku yetu imefika Hakuna taye zuia Ajali ya maulana Pete tutafishanwa Mie, mie Nimesha patikana Na yule, nume Wakapenzi shanienzi Let's 
Tak er Ginny. 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 Mark time, mark time, mark time. Come on, police. Come on, police. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Stop. Simama. The right. Geuka. Ati. Eh. Eh. Ati. Alafu. Weka wako. Ai, 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 DJ, DJ, cut it. What if we get it?
Aleluya, 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 aleluya
Pole pole tu aina fresha Pole pole tu Tukaenda naye Baba kwake Aburi moyo kwa mtu DJ Kata Habari zenu nyinyi wote Bwana Yesu asifiwe Kwa majina naitwa Elizabeth Mudeu ama misi si wa Kimoi na nimeokoka Yesu ni Bwana. Na afternoon ya leo niko na furaha kubwa sana sababu ya hao watoto wetu John and Nelly you have made us proud. Tuliwalea tukawaonyesha njia ya kupitia na tunashukuru Mungu kwa sababu amuja to disappoint. John you have proved to be someone who can do things by your own na ninajua ya kwamba utasimamisha jamii yako Nelly John ni mtu wa mwenye saingini apendi maneno mingi hata mimi mama yake saingini simuelewi amefika mahali ambako <laughs> anafanyanga vitu zake amenyamaza but at the end of the day unapata amefanya vitu professionally and i really like that kwa hivyo congratulations Mungu awabariki na awe nanyi I was being rebuked by one of my friends akasema kwamba nimesema sina msichana na wao wamejaa hapa lakini nashukuru nyinyi wote ni watoto wangu sasa bwana asifiwe sana Neli umekaribishwa kwetu sasa huko ndio kwenu lakini pia mama yako pia tumekupea kijana sasa wewe hauna kijana mmoja ukupia na kijana bwana <laughs> asifiwe sana na muendelee na kubarikiwa sana Uliwabusha Kato wa mtumwani Watumishi wako umiwapa Nelly tu nataka uende huko huo ambaza na mzuri Ukua ambaza ni mzuri eh, Tutaona tutaona tu wenzako huko Watakupia watakuya Watakuya huko pia wakuya kutavu Kutakuta waziana In the process Nae mutua Atapaa muziana na kuya kutoka pandiyo na <laughs> mu exchange Ule ene msiangini kwa sasa mama wako wana msiana kuringa nae. Asandeni. Ok, good afternoon. Ok, just as you have heard mama Nelly. Nelly is there. My only daughter, loving daughter. I love her so much but I'll try my best to at least to compose myself. Nelly is a good girl. Uh, well disciplined. I like the way you are and uh, the way John is. Uh, you are doing well, you guys. I pray that God will continue to help you and uh, you make a good uh, family. Every hustler gets in there. Where the hustle go come the way. Your own in no Amen. 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 If you don't find work to your own, God self go to his own. And flesh go proper bone. Amen. 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 If you believe you say amen. If you believe you say amen. Nah. 
Nataka kushukuru Mungu kwa sababu umbali huu Mungu ametuleta. Joe bila mmesikia. Yeye ni mtoto ambaye ni wa surprises. Kwa mdogo aongei sana mengi kidogo tu. Na ukimwona takwa class aongei lakini matokeo ni kwamba yeye anapoform na tumeona Nashukuru Mungu kwa sababu yeye yeah, anampenda Kristo na tunampenda sana. Na kwa kweli leo hii tumeshuhudia kwamba anaweza kupata msichana naye wanapendana na tumemwona naye ni msichana chopi wanazungumza nazi na tunashukuru Mungu. Tunamkaribisha kisi karibu sana. Jamira mkuu huko ni mingi sio kama hapa Nairobi. Watoto yetu ambao ni Neri na uh, na John Mungu awabariki congratulations mwende hao maisha ni maisha mazuri Mungu awabariki sana thank you very much Great nook sema hongera sana uh, uh, John he is kunzuri sana kwa friends sote kama jamii Nataka kushukuru wale wote ambao wali waliusika sana sana na hasa sana wazazi wa msichana wa Neri thank you so much kwa sababu ya vile ametubariki um, na msichana na tumeona kweli Neli ni msichana ambao ni sawa sawa ameumbika ni mrembo na ataendelea kuwa mrembo zaidi mpige mali makofi na alama yake kamba wacha wale mnajia kitamba wacha mimi nasema huyu mjukuu wangu John amejishindia kama mrembo na wanataka kuanzia mboma lao na ninawapatia asemu kidogo na langu kitu bayanze wako kota mali pa kukaa waje wajenga kanyumba hapo wakitoka Nairobi wanaenda huko tupigie shusha makofi nami nawasalimu katika jina la Yesu naitwa Reverend Grace Mbiti nimeokoka Mama Kenjo ni huko nyuma. Tumezaliwa na huyo mama anaenda. Bwana wabariki sana. Njoo tunawapenda sana na Neli. Neli karibu. Tunakupenda na tutaendelea na kushirikiana. Bwana watendee mema. Neli shikilia hiyo harusi. Na siku moja tutakucha kuona huko kwenu ambao umeoleka. Sasa umekuwa mpya huko lakini utafunzwa mambo mengi utafunzwa kikisi na luka ile nyingine ambayo inawasunguka eh, mababa, eh, baba zenu wazazi wenu huko. Nawe John pia. Nawe utakuja huko tukakutakuvuta kitu kidogo kikamba kidogo tu ukiambiwa wacha una unajibu kwa kwa raha. Kwa hiyo wote naenda kusema ni asanti sana. Uhusiano ume ume ume, ume, ume kolea. Pasta amesema mambo mengi. Lakini yale yote ambao yameongea na pasta wale wengine ambao umepata mawaidha ni ya kweli. A wedding is a one day celebration but marriage is forever. Thank you very much. Mungu awabariki. John, how are you? You know you, ne you never talk. But today I've heard your voice. Komzima. Asante. How about uh Nelly, how are you? Have you ever met? Not yet. Now I'm deliberate because I've not met Nelly. Sijawahi kukutana na Nelly, lakini I've met John. And I want Nelly to know I met John when he was an infant. Akiwa baby. Kadogo. Nikakashika kwa mikono yangu na nikaka dedicate John, do you know that? Do you remember that? Or you can't remember? I think John cannot remember. I want to tell you, God has a lot of blessings for you. And if you keep the faith, I'm telling you, John, you will see things which you, you cannot believe. And I want also to let you know, God will open doors for you and your wife, this beautiful girl that I'm seeing here, to become fathers of other many other children that will come. And you will be proud another, another day to stand before them the way I am standing, to usher them into a marriage like the one we are seeing here today. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir.
Nataka uende unilete mtoto. Ndio. Mtoto. 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 Hey, mtoto. We. Mtoto. Ndio. 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 Hey. Hey. Usikufa kwa usio kwa usio kwa. Hey. We. 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 Yaani mnataka mbio mtu anafikiri mmeendea watoto wenu. Eh? Dress ni ndefu lakini. Acha toende. Pigia makofi. Nataka uende uniletee mtu amevaa miwani. Haraka. Bio, 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 bio. Kudangaya nini? Oi! Oi! Ukifika kalia kiti, kalia kiti ukifika. Kalia kiti, kalia kiti ukifika. Ukifika kalia kiti. Kalia kiti ukifika, kalia kiti ukifika. Haya. One, two. Muko wanine? Wow. Haya. Sawa sawa. Huyu ni wanani? Wako. Haya we kaa chini. Asante. Barikiwe. Kaa hapo. Huyu ni wanani? Ah, keti chini. Huyu ni wanani? Kaya keti chini. Wacha neema ya Bwana ikutoshe ndugu yangu. Fuata kiti huko. Ah, fuata. Eh, ah, usirudisha. Iko huko. Iko huko. Usipopata kiti umetoka game. Now be fast. Be fast. Be ah, be fast. Be fast. Wonderful. Wonderful. Ukipata hakuna kiti tembea na ye na Yesu sawa sawa ah mko tayari mko tayari nataka uende unilete mtu amevaa kitenge haraka mtu amevaa kitenge 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 woi Woi, ah, hotel hiyo sai, hotel hiyo sai. Sai ni huku. Ya wanaume ni huku. Good, 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 good. Aya, aya. Hauna kiti? Hauna kiti, bro? Aya, tembea na Yesu. Amen. Nataka uende uniletee katululu. Bio. Katululu. Bio, 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 katululu. Bio, bio, bio. Bio. Woi. 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 Wow, 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 wow. Eh, DJ, 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 DJ. Yaani unapitia tu hapa. Mlango wa mbinguni unapitia tu hapa. Woi, woi, woi. Hauna? Hauna? Bye. Mko tayari? Nataka uende uniletee mtu ako na nevu. Woi! 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 Wa? Wa umeendao wenyewe ndio maana umeshindwa hata. Unaendao wenyewe kwa nini? Woi! Haya <laughs> kachi nitoende kazi sasa. Tuko finali sasa. Tuko nini? Tuko finali. Tuko finali. Eh, hey, na hapa watu. Eish. Hey, hapa watu. Hapa watu. Haya. Nataka uende uniletee Samsung. Samsung yote. Hey, 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 hey.
International and our bishop is here. So we are so glad for uh, John and Nelly. And you've seen the way we love her. Do we love her? Are you seeing as if we love her? Yes. Okay. So we're going to take care of her. Mama Nelly, don't be afraid. We shall take care of her. <laughs> And they like you. Somebody said that in, uh, to increase you. So, so God, so may God increase you. So next time, the bishop will come to dedicate your child. Amen. And he said that I had. I'd say I'd do it very soon. Isn't it? So mugo abariki no atende no atende no. Ja 
Chalon chalo, chalon chalo, chalon chalo, chalon chalo. Yazu tesu ya mangalisa, ni shuchu tesu ya mangalisa. Chalon chalo, chalon chalo, chalon chalo. Yazu tesu ya mangalisa. Yani, Yani, Mona Chuko, and I'll pick up. Ati Maeni Leo, Nisi Kuyetu, Sikuyetu Muhimu, Harusi Etu, Uepo and Uyote, Quetuni Kitu, Quetuni Nindu, Leo Nakesho. Harusi mahua, ngari ngari wanapendeza Leo ni furaha, shangwe na furaha Harusi mahua, kabasa msuti na shela Wacha tufurahi, sote tufurahi Fiti, fiti, fiti Haiku ala, hizi, tufi, maybe Leo, hii Na kapa tulipo, leo siku yetu Impo, muki, muku Harusi Fiti, fiti, baby Haiku ala, fiti Tufike, baby Leo, hii Na kapa tulipo Pio siku yetu Ipo, mupimu Fiti, ya harusi Sasa nyumba moja Mwili kumoja Kila kitu ni moja Tue pamoja Upendo na ongeza Nawe ongeza Heshima na pandisha, tuwe pamoja Sweetie, sweetie, sweetie Haiku ala, easy, to feed my baby Leo, easy Sasa wewe ni mimi, mimi ni wewe Wendo wanda ni wangu, rafiki yangu Sasa wewe ni mimi, mimi ni wewe Wendo wanda ni wangu, rafiki yangu Na wazazi wameona wakatulusu Kwa furaha wakasema hey Tume wabariki na mwenyezi So I would like you to put your hands together Probably this is the first task that you're going to do together Husband and wife Nelly can't cut cake that cake alone John you can't cut it alone Not that you can't but you shouldn't it means your concerted efforts in this marriage will take you places. That's why that song that says, Tumekua, Wamoja, we are now one thing. You're going to do it together. From today, in the presence of God, the presence of all these witnesses and angels together with us. From today, you're one. One person, one. One flesh, one. Thingy. Okay. Let's put our knife together. Very good. There we go. Woo! Fantastic. So na mwa check is a honey up on the beer. Go and warm it in the microwave. You will be doing this at least for one year. Let's see. The first one year, John is upon a video. Are you here? And when it doesn't come that way, come and report. Fantastic. Okay, John, let's see how you will beautify this queen with good food. And it's not just the food, it's the love that accompanies the food. Unampea kadogo kwa nini? Hiyo ndio love. 
eating love fantastic so now Nelly you will look at him and he will look at you concentrate on each other like that wow John is very gentle okay Nelly it's your turn mm -hmm. there is love in the air Ooh. when is Valentine Fantastic. When Marco, Sikwa Wakati, Wafura Hatu. When Marco, Pia Wakati. Hata wama chosi We mawako haupimiki Kwa machira fulani tu We mawako ni kila wakati Na kila nyakati Hata sasa ni mema Thank you so much for showing love to John and Nelly. And thank you to the pastorate that has chosen to stay with us. A very special thanks to the GEO of Gospel Centers International. To Mesia History Yak and John Wamtoka Mbali. Nabado and Angoja Kushika Mto. Iyo to Mesia. So we want to really appreciate. And from a very personal point of view, I want to say thank you to John and Nelly. Uh, this was my very first uh, wedding to, to, to lead in planning and thank you for taking the risk. Yeah? Not pride, not best, but I want to really appreciate that. Thank you Lord that Father Lord this day was planned with God and we have established you for God. We are grateful and we want to say thank you in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you for the good weather. Lord, receive all the honor and glory. Thank you, Lord, for all the plans that we have gone well. Lord, receive all the honor and glory. We thank you and we give you praise. All the single 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 all the single